had a fantastic week so far. There it is. That's the way to end it for Louis Hustazen. A lot of us are playing together for the third time, and as a team, that's a big advantage to have the same guys in the team, and we were working hard to get that win. We're ready for it. If you guys win, who'll be the first person at the bar buying the drinks? Oh, that'll be me. <laughs> This year's President's Cup marks the fourth appearance for South Africa's Louis Ustasen. But this one has a particular meaning. Being South African as well, it's always special when you have someone that was my idol growing up. I've been through his foundation and he's always been a leader in, in, in my eyes. Louis is the product of the Ernie Els and Fancourt Foundation. Established in 1999 to educate young golfers and grow the game in South Africa. Whenever we met Ernie, it was a special time and thought on what we can do to one day get where he is. And he was always open to talking to and a great role model to, to follow in golf. The foundation has produced such President's Cup stars as Brandon Grace, Charles Schwartzel, and of course, Louis who has gone on to win more than 20 professional tournaments worldwide, including the 2010 Open Championship. It's just relentless, wonderful goal from Louis Eustazen. But there's not one player in the field that wouldn't like a little bit of Louis's tempo and his talents. In 2013, he played his way onto his first President's Cup team, alongside fellow foundation members Grace Schwartzel, and none other than his mentor. Yeah, it's weird, you know, I mean, uh, Louis and Brandon and even Charles, I mean, I've known them since they were so young. And now they, they're playing on the, on the big stage. It's, it's quite, quite nice. And take a look at that. Two years later, Louis would team with Grace. Hello. What a team this has been the last two days. To achieve what no other international teammates had ever accomplished. Now the South African power duo powers on. Perfect partnership of 4 and 0, the very first time it's been done by an international side in President's Cup history. In 2017, Louis played in his third consecutive President's Cup and was the leading point earner for the international team, which included a win over Patrick Reed in the Sunday singles. And Louis curls it in. In 2018, he got to work early in order to make his fourth consecutive team, capturing a long sought after National Open. Louis Eustazen has won his first South African Open Championship, and he's won it by a handsome six shots. And posted five top tens in 18 events on the PGA Tour. How about this touch? Louis Oosthuizen! Now Louis sets his sights on Royal Melbourne and playing for his mentor and fellow countrymen. You can see he's really invested in this and he's, he's really excited about it and he's brought great things already to the table and we're all very excited to, to have him as our captain. Everything is in good favor for us. It's Australia, which is the only place we've won the trophy before, so hopefully um, they can go and do it again.